I was just going to ask you about your daughter. I saw the story on KSL, and she has um, what kind of cancer? She has kidney cancer. Kidney cancer. They took her kidney out, the tumor. It was about the size of my fist. Took her out. And she's two? Ten months. Ten months. She was, she was eight months at the time. I think she Actually, she's 11 months now. She'll be one years old September 17th. She's battling. She has chemo every week until December, and then hopefully she's cancer-free. She's tougher than me. She's smiling with cancer and chemotherapy, and... Football helps me get away, man. Uh, I just had an hour and a half where I can get away and just focus on this. Um, you know, sometimes I'm not able to do that fully, but most of the time I am. You know, it's never away from your mind, no matter what you do, is it? Well, Friday, every Friday, um, we have to go to sit in the children's hospital, and she gets hooked up, and they give her chemo, and I practice here on Friday, and it's hard not to think about it, man. My daughter's up doing chemo, and I'm out here running around playing a game, so yeah, it's, it's different. Yeah, man, this is not that important. It is, but it isn't, man. I got my sick daughter, and you, know, you can't stress too much about things like this when you have bigger things going on. You know, we lost a teammate this year. I just lost a coach the other day, Aaron Alford. I mean, we've had things happen already. We faced an adversity as a team, and me personally, with my daughter being sick, my knee injury, Coach Alford, Gaius, I mean, it's been, it makes you understand that family and friends are very, very important, and this is like a job, you know, we love it and we're going to give our best, but at the end of the day, you want to appreciate the people around you. And uh, I'm thankful for my teammates. My coach came to the hospital, my teammates did. Uh, I mean, they've been nothing but supportive in this situation. Oh, absolutely. I'm very close to Trevor and his family, and and uh, she's in our thoughts and prayers. And and uh, Trevor, you know, he's the team leader. He's our, he's our guy, and, and uh, I absolutely am aware of... Uh, you know, his tough situation. She's a ham, man. Whatever the camera's on or people around her, she's smiling. She's a big chubby baby. She's a, she's unbelievable. And does it look well for her, the prognosis? Yeah, they think um, they think that she's going to not only be cancer-free, but they think it's going to be the chances of it coming back are sl very, very slim. When would you know, Trey? Next week we have a full body scan for any cancer, and then in December she'll have another one. So this week's kind of, next week's really big.